makes your garden grow water and sunshine what makes your spirit grow knowing that she'll be mine Pardon my disheveled appearance. <laughs> Hello everyone, welcome to Freedom Homestead. I'm Tangi. Um, it's actually Friday and it is the last day of 2021. Um, I've heard people say before that they would be happy to see a year go and I've never been one to say that, but this year has been particularly challenging and I am looking forward to a brand new year full of possibilities. Um, and I know a lot of people have like a, a word that they set for the year. And my word is peace. <laughs> I am looking for peace. Um, like I said, this year's just been really challenging and I'm just, I'm, I'm ready to get close to the Lord, get close to the dirt and just be at peace and not feel so much chaos around me. So um, anyway, let me know down the uh, comment section, do you have a year? Now that is not our family word. That is the Tangy word for the year is peace. And so um, anyway, let's, we're all hoping for a better year and um, yeah, just one with of peace and contentment. So uh, anyway, um, like I said, I went to the grocery store today Normally I go on Saturdays, but it is a holiday tomorrow and um, where I shop normally is pretty chaotic uh, during the holidays. Uh, today was busy, but I imagine tomorrow will be busier. And uh, not only that, but I haven't been to the grocery store in two weeks. So um, we were definitely out of a lot of things. And uh, yeah, I decided to go ahead and go today, especially since I have the day off. So let me show you what I got. If you look down uh, below around here, I will have the prices for you. Because the prices have changed so much, um, it's hard for me to remember what the prices are because they've changed so much. So anyway, all right, let me show you what I got. Here's the spread. Uh, you might be able to tell that I did most of my shopping at Sam's Club today. Um, so from here to about here is Sam's Club. The rest of it is Aldi. So let's start over here. Um, I am down to the very last bit of dishwasher tabs. This is the brand that I like. It does the best in my dishwasher. So I got 105 tabs. Um, they were in stock with their bath tissue, so I went ahead and grabbed one. Um, this is about $19 and some change. We got some organ. oh, here we go. We got three pounds of organic bananas. Parker asked to grab them, so we did. Um, and these, these are more expensive than all these organic bananas, but Aldi didn't have any, so, um, so that's why we got those. We got some Top Ramen, just a big case of them. And I also got some, uh, a big box of trash bags. Back here, they did not have their plain on the border chips. We really like them. They're very thin and crispy. Kind of like the Catalina chips that you get at uh, Walmart, but the price tends to uh, be a little bit better at Sam's Club. But they did have the queso uh, flavor, so I'm hoping that that's good. I also, um, for Jack and Emily's lunch, got some sour cream and onion chips. Um, this was on sale. This is their shredded Parmesan. It's normally like $9 and some change, but the instant savings made it about $7 and some change. And so um, I really like the fresh, um, this kind of shredded Parmesan. It is so, so good, and it tastes a lot better than the canned stuff. It really does. It makes a big difference. We are completely out of our everything bagel seasoning. Um, but it feels like this was a better price than what I get at Aldi. So I uh, went ahead and got that. Girls. I love, love, love Sam's Club Organic Carrots. This big, huge thing was like, it's a five pound bag and it was less than $3 um, or around $3. Anyway, these are wonderful. Their pork loin was a really good price. It was two, what was it? Two, two twenty-eight a pound. This beautiful pork loin. So I will cut this into um, small roasts, and then I can decide later if I want to leave it as a roast or if I want to leave it as chops. But anyway, I'm happy to have it. Their maple syrup was only ten dollars, so I got one of those. Um, I got their picante mild uh, salsa. 
I like the green salsa that I bought at my um, salvage store, but Jack prefers the red salsa. So I got him some picante sauce. Really looking forward to making my own. Uh, I got a big thing of French vanilla coffee creamer for those that like that. Um, I got some orange juice, pulp free. Um, got some string cheese. I uh, got some uncured applewood smoked ham. This pound and a half container was just a little more than $6. So that was a good price. And that is everything I got at Sam's Club. And I spent $151 and some change there. Okay, the rest of this was Aldi. I spent about $37. I just needed a few things. Um, got a gallon of milk. This 10 pound bag of russet potatoes was less than $4. Got a quart of heavy whipping cream. It was about $3 and some change. Their avocados were on sale for 59 cents a piece. I got six of them. Um, I got a thing of mild cheddar cheese for sandwiches. Um, I got a box of gallon size freezer bags, uh, some sweet onions, some French onion dip, some sour cream, some Duke's mayonnaise. They had this in their special items, cream of chicken soup and cream of mushroom soup organic. They were, I think $1.29 a can. So I just got two of each. I got six cans of tomato sauce, four cans of green beans, and two cans of mushrooms. And that is everything I got from Aldi. And like I said, I spent $37 and some change. So some of the things that we are going to be having this week, I am going to be making a roast chicken. Um, I might do mashed potatoes, roasted carrots, something along those lines. Um, another night we are going to do pork chops, green beans, and probably like, I don't know, something roasted, um, some sort of roasted vegetable. Maybe maybe I'll do like, well, I have some uh, winter squash I could probably do. So yeah, so we'll do pork chops, green beans, and then maybe um, an acorn squash or a butternut squash. That sounds really good. Uh, let's see, another night, another night we will do potato soup. Uh, I might do potato soup. Um, so that's, uh, we've got cheese still from like the last time I got groceries. We've got potatoes. I've got lots of frozen cauliflower. Um, we've got heavy whipping cream and sour cream and bacon bits and all the good things. So, uh, we'll just do a loaded potato soup or a loaded potato soup. Um, let's see. So pork Okay. Another night, um, our neighbor, um, that their property borders ours, um, they gifted us for Christmas a couple of uh, chuck roasts. So we'll do a uh, roast one night. I don't know if we'll do Mississippi roast or if I'll just do like a regular roast or I don't know, I might dress it up somehow. But uh, anyway, so we'll do that as our protein one night and then whatever sides um, that sound good. Uh, we have lots of um, fresh vegetables still in the fridge. Um, we've got cauliflower, broccoli, and um, iceberg lettuce. So we could easily do um, a salad. We could just do, I don't know, we could do a broccoli and cauliflower salad too. That sounds good. And then of course, one night this week, we will either do tacos or nachos just because I love it. All right, so those are just some of the things that I am thinking in my noggin. I need to write them down before I forget. Um, but anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this grocery haul. I hope you all have a very, very, very happy new year. Um, again, let me know down in the comments, what is your, do you have a word for the year? Do you have a goal that you're trying to reach? Are you participating in a pantry challenge? Maybe I am not because we are still working on building our pantry since we lost everything earlier this year. Um, and so, yeah, we're not in a position where we can just eat right out of it for a month or so. Um, so we are going to continue to work on building it up. Um, anyway, that's all I've got for you guys today. I hope you enjoyed it. And until next time, Remember to be vigilant, to be prayerful, and be prepared. God bless you all, and we'll catch you in the next one. Bye, guys.